Hey, what's up, YouTube land? Eddie Hill, and today we be we will be reviewing these G1 Transformers blind bags. I found these at my local Dollar Tree for a buck a piece, so we're gonna take them out and look at the figures. We take a look at one of the good ones, Megatron. <laughs> Just to show you how good this figure is, I'm trying to do a close up which is really good paint sculpt on this figure. Definitely looks like G1 Megatron from the cartoon. So this is my one of my favorites of these blind mags. So now we're going to off to the side with that. And we're going to check out an Autobot. And it's going to be Optimus Prime. My favorite Autobot, Optimus Prime. Here he is in all his G1 Cartoon Optimus Prime Glory. And I love this. And these were worth five bucks for these. So, you know. Now we're going to take a look at another Decepticon. And it's Soundwave. Soundwave. I am Soundwave. Soundwave Superior. Autobots Inferior. And that's my sound wave imitation. Yeah. And he looks really good in paint. I love the paint on these figures. They look accurate completely. Throw that off the side. And now for the most loved of all Transformers. The known in G1 cartoon. It's Bumblebee. Oh yeah. Little Bumblebee. And he looks... Very impressive. All accurate and G1 accurate. I love it. Even the back is well sculpted and painted. These figures are well sculpted and painted. Now for the last one. My boy. Grimlock. Yeah. Now this Grimlock is not Transformers robot mode. They have this one in his dinosaur mode. And it looks like G1 Grimlock. He's painted. Oh, I love that. I love how that looks. Look at all that paint and sculpting. They nailed all these figures head on. And these are new to me. I haven't seen these before. But if you have, let me know in the comments. And these are the Transformers. More than meets the eye. More than meets the eye. Limited edition. And it has the names of the characters, which is great. And this is Eddie Hill. Moving on. And rock on and rock out, people. <laughs>